welcome back to another video so here we're gonna do a skin high fade with a beard so here we started off with the number two guard open just removing the hair on the sides to make it easier to set in the first guideline and just removing the bulk with the number two guard getting it nice and smooth to set in the first guideline <clears throat> combing the hair while you do it as well so here i got my wool seniors making the zero line and you just want to make it straight and stretch your skin as well and do that the whole way around <clears throat> So here I've got my wool bowling clippers and I'm just bowling it out from the sides, getting it all nice and skin. And stretch your skin while you do this as well. Because you want to make it all clean when you go in with the shavers. Get that nice clean look. So here we've got the bronze series nice shaver and you just want to skin it all out, make it nice and smooth. You don't want to go right to the top of the line it's going to be hard to take out that bottom line and you just want to leave just a little bit like a, i'll say half an inch from zero to skin i'm going in all type of different directions as well to make it all skin i'm using my fade brush as well so here to set in that first guard and i've got the 0.5 guard open and I'm going about an inch up making the first line staying consistent the whole way around okay to take out that line I've got the 0.5 guard say halfway then gradually start closing it to knock out that bottom line I'm doing that the whole way around as you can see is slowly disappearing with that zero guard If that bottom line don't come out, you're going to go back with the, either a trimmer or a bowling clipper to make it all clean from skin to zero. Here I've got the bowling clipper now. Just have to go back to get the bottom line. So now with the second guard line, I'm going to create with the number one guard open. I'm going about another inch up. Staying consistent the whole way around, combing the hair as well. That second guard line with the number one. Close then open. Hey, I'm going back with the 0.5 guard to take out that line we just created with the number one. And I'm just flicking at that line with the 0.5 guard closed. And slowly slowly open it when you go higher but stay under that line where you've done the number one and then you can see that line slowly disappearing and if that line don't go you have to go back with a 0.5 guard open no guard and just want to take them little dark spots Please hit the like button and the comment. Let me know what you guys think. Hey, I got the 0.5 guard. I'm working on that line. You want to pay attention to every detail as well while you do this. See them little dogs for you, so I'm gonna go over and make it all nice and clean. Here, for the third guard line, I've created with the 1.5 guard open, going about another inch up. Start with it open, then all the way closed. You can see that fade coming through now slowly as well. I'll go back with the number one guard open and you just want to go under where you've done that 1.5 guard to get that nice smooth look so 
Damn, boys, look at that fade already. We're looking sharp. Ed is going back with the 0.5 god. This is detailed work, so I'm going back. Now, this is a number two god open. And, and I'm not going straight up, I'm just flicking up, if you know what I mean. Just to get that nice smooth look. Now you can see the fade has come through. Here yeah, now I'm doing clipper over comb. So you can sit nicely the hair hanging from the top. The nice smooth. Yeah, I'm going back with the 0.5 guard now. Get that little detail work. Here, you just want to repeat the same thing with the two guard open, just removing the hair, setting the bold line with the wool seniors, making it straight. Depends how high or low he wants it, he wanted high, I'm climbing on the chair. Yeah, I'm stretching the skin while I do this as well. Get all skin, get that nice zero look. Let's try hit 400 subscribers as all. Please share the video, I'll leave uh, the machines I use in the description down below yeah I'm just skinning it all out get that nice look hey with the 0.5 guard here this time I'm using the ward magic clip 0.5 guard open made the first line to knock it out I'm gonna start with the lever halfway then all the way close and I'm stretching the skin as well while I do this Take that bottom line out. Hey, I'm just gonna go back with the bowling clipper. Just making sure it's all faded the bottom line. Here, the number one guard now. Open, making the second guideline. Going an inch up as well. To take out that line, go back with the 0.5 guard closed and open it slowly, slowly to take out that second guideline. Stay tuned for our next videos coming soon. Here, just going back with the 0.5. No guard open, using the corner of the blades as well. Here, with the 1.5 guard now open, making the last guideline. And I'm going straight up with the 0.5 open and close it. Hey, I'm going to do some clip over comb as well on this side, so the hair sits down nicely. Just removing all the extra hair, getting it nice so it could sit down nicely. Hey, just going over the fade with the number one guard open and closed, getting out of them dark spots. Now back with the 0.5 god. Just going back to making sure it's all faded nicely. See that fade coming through now. So here for the box, we're gonna spray some hairspray to hold it down. Then we're gonna go with the comb where the direction is going. 
to be easy to set in the guard line for the box. And for me, all luck starting off with the left hand side. And I'm going straight along, just tapping at that line. You don't want to press too hard as well. It's getting that nice crisp line. And I'm making my way to the right. Want to keep it natural as possible as they don't want to push too back here for the side I'm just doing the same thing i'm using the wall detailers on this the cordless ones they are pretty good i bought these the other day they are doing the best so now i'm gonna go back and walk my blade i'm stretching the skin while i do this to get that crisp line out as you can see so here with the box i'm stretching the beard, sorry, I mean <laughs> the beard has pulled the hair back with the comb, making that line pop. And I'm gonna go back with the blade, stretching the skin while I do this as well. Cause you don't, you don't wanna cut the guy sitting on your chair. Just do it under the air as well because there is hair, very little hair. Here, I told him blow it in the cheek, starting off with the bottom, and my way to the top. And you don't want to push too long, I kept it as natural as possible as well. The line here, doing the same thing, I'm fading it with a 0.5 guard open, and then all the way closed. Then, with a 1.5, just flicking at that line to make it a bit lighter, nice, faded in nicely with the 0.5 guard now yeah i'm doing the same thing i comb the hair out from the back getting all that hair make it nice 90 degree angle and i do it as well on the chin get that nice angle and i'm just tapping out i'm not pressing too hard because uh, and the neck is very sensitive as well Okay, just blading it up now in that nice line, nice and sharp. Here okay, for the top line, just turn him blow it in the cheek. Getting that nice line. So here's the cut. Please let me know in the section below what you guys think. Please like, share, and subscribe.